Hi everyone, I'm Michaela. And I'm Andrea, and we're from High Point Companies in Northern Colorado. High Point Companies and the women of FWA have partnered together to bring you this educational video made by women for women. This here is a model of a chain link fence. Starting here, you have your terminal post. Your terminal post is larger in diameter than your line post. Attached to the terminal post is the fabric, which is held on by a tension bar, which the tension bar is held onto your terminal post with a tension band. This right here is your line post. It is a supportive post that connects to your top rail and they are both connected by a loop cap and this is what that looks like. Your top rail is then connected to your terminal posts and they are connected by a rail end and also by a brace band. And then you have your bottom tension wire and that is connected to your terminal posts by brace bands. Your fabric is then attached to your bottom tension wire with hog rings. Here we have the brace assembly. The brace assembly is made up of a brace rail, which is attached to your first line post and your terminal post. To the line post, it is a two hole rail end, which attaches to the truss rod tightener. And then you have the truss rod here, which the truss rod is attached to your terminal post with a brace band. This is a regular, rail end and then you have your two hole rail end. Your fabric is attached to your frame with ties. You have an easy tie and you also have a stick tie. And then you finish off your project with dome caps that look like this and your fence sign and then you're done. Thanks for learning about chain link parts with us. And stay tuned for our next educational video.